what's going on everyone welcome back to another video we are currently right now in louisiana if you watched my previous video you'd notice i did mention we're heading over to louisiana and i want to apologize there was supposed to be another video from the southwest florida uh kind of mini trip uh it just didn't go all that well kind of had a a little bit of trouble um really finding the fish that day or our second day but yeah we are on the uh the new tar Lewis tarpon demo boat we're gonna really be putting it to the test these three days here in louisiana today is of course day one i've got maggie behind the camera this is her first time she's really excited uh i'm really excited as well we're gonna really get a feel for how this boat fishes uh hopefully we'll be landing some giant redfish some sheep's head uh maybe some little trout and stuff here and there um but today we're just gonna throw lures just kind of fish around uh we're joined by my buddy johnny stabile he's right behind us following us out we're about to head on out out of the marsh here and uh hopefully we're gonna knock out some uh big fish it's 8 30 sun's out which is really really uh how, how do i say it's it's very rare for the sun to come out here in louisiana but we got sun today a little breezy hopefully we'll knock out some fish so stay tuned let's go ahead and run on out let's do it guys Did you see him? It was about a 36 incher. I think I might have just seen a redfish back in this creek. I got a gold ball in there. I could just creep up in here. Looks like it's about a foot deep. I swear, he's in here somewhere. I saw him twice come up. It's a nice drone. It's a giant sheep's head. It's like a 20 inch sheep's head. Yeah, there he is. It's a drum, it's a drum. All right, let's see. Yeah, he's on it. Oh my god, that was a sheep's head. That was a sheep's head, that was like 24 inches. <laughs> oh my, yeah. that was a huge I that sheep. I got it real close. Nice, good job. He was huge. I think it stunk, he would have been like right on it. He was, I mean he was like, <laughs> came up to it and then I twitched he it and he was like, <laughs> I, I think he just, he got smart to the bait. It wasn't what he thought it was. Literally just missed him. He's looking for it. Ready, Maggie? He's looking for it. Somewhere right here. Got him. Yep, there we go. There it is. <laughs> I'll take it. I'll take it. That was sick. I missed him the first cast. I saw his mouth open up on it. It's a good one. There we go. All right, guys. Well, welcome to Louisiana. Uh, it's really cold here. It's really windy here, but the sun's out, and I was able to sight fish a redfish, which I've only done maybe two or three times in all of my trips to Louisiana. I've been probably fished almost 10 days now. And uh, we're whacking this creek here, had a gulp on, and we found a nice red. I saw one bull earlier, he spooked, and I uh, saw a giant sheep's head. You guys just saw that, and we're able to grab a red right here. This is a nice one. He looked a lot smaller in the water, but, man, he's he fat. Yeah, he's, like, almost 
30 inches. Oh. All right. Super bright red fish with a blue tail. Beautiful First fish. red fish of the 2022 Louisiana trip. Beautiful fish. Really pretty. Grab the gulp right there. I mean, it took two tries, but I got him the second time. I kind of got a little quick on him. But, I mean, Louisiana, there's just nothing different. This is definitely a trip I think everyone has to take at least once in their life. <laughs> there's so many redfish here. They're so aggressive. It's just a blast. All right, we're going to go ahead and get him unhooked. Back in the water. There you go, first <laughs> first redfish of the trip. And uh, yeah, we're back in this really narrow creek. It's really nothing I ever did when I came to Louisiana. Usually we're kind of on the outside throwing more open water, but there's been a lot of fish back in this little creek here. We saw two and, on this point here. And Nutri-Rat. And we saw a Nutri-Rat. Maggie's really excited about the Nutri-Rats. <laughs> Shout out to Deer Meat for dinner um, with like the Nutri-Rat hunting videos. We just saw two and I've never seen one here in Louisiana. They're very funky looking. We're gonna try to find another one, but yeah, there's a lot of cool stuff out here. Let's uh, let's keep fishing. Really big fish right here. There he goes. Oh, dude. Like a third, that was like a 35 inch red coming right around the point right here. <sighs> Didn't want the gulp, surprisingly. Last one did. Something there. I don't know what it was. It was a big, it was a big boil that moved like, could have just been a big sheep or something, but. Yep, there we go. There we go. <laughs> there it is. Barely see him. Bright red fish and that dark stuff. Oh, I think he's a little bit bigger than the last one. Oh. Nice fish. Could barely see that fish. Just the faintest little bit of red. There we go. Oh boy. Oh boy. Stay out of the trolling motor. Yeah, he's definitely bigger than the last one. I think this one's closer to 30 inches. Nice, 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 nice. Man. Popped off on that gulp. It's funny because last fish we saw was a bigger fish. He wasn't interested in it. Oh, maybe the water was cleaner, so maybe he got a good look at it, but <sighs> kind of funny how one fish can be kind of spooked on a bait and the next one be super aggressive. Oh. Fish number two. Figured we'd measure this one. I think he's maybe 27, four, five, six, seven, eight, 28. No, he's 27. Beauty. Beauty. Pop that gulp out, and there we go. Second redfish of the day. How's he look, Maggie? Beautiful. Really pretty, bright orange. Fat Definitely and healthy. Fat and healthy, yeah. I think that's, <laughs> that's the big thing. Beautiful. Send this guy back, but got ourselves a little upgrade. Went from like maybe a 24, 25 inch fish to like a 27. We're gonna find our bulls today at some point. If I can keep sight fishing, we're gonna find our bulls. That's awesome. Oh. Let's 
go, two fish down. Yep, 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 yep. Okay. Oh, there's one. There's one. That's a big one. That is a big one. <sighs> All right, so we have spent like the last two hours struggling and we had just seen a giant about, I don't know, three minutes ago. He spooked. And uh, I was just thinking, man, there's gotta be more out here. There's no way we just saw a giant and there's there's not others with him. And I took the gulp shrimp. I saw a shadow, like the darkest, like, or I don't know how to explain it, but I could barely see this fish right here that I hooked. It was just like the slightest little shadow sliding and I threw it in front of it and boom, got thumped on the gulp shrimp. I've only got 30 pound leader, so I'm gonna try to take this guy easy. I think he's probably about 36, 37 inches. Whew. That's awesome. That is awesome. Big red fish on light tackle. All right, we're getting this guy in. It's a nice one, a real nice one. It's like they're almost purpley in this water, almost purpley. <laughs> Check that out. Huge, huge head on this fish. Come on, come on. That is a big one, a really big one, really, really big one. This fish is a lot bigger than I was thinking for a gulp shrimp on a quarter ounce jig head. <laughs> oh my gosh, a lot bigger than I was thinking. Check that out. Oh my gosh. That is a big fish. <laughs> <laughs> that is a big fish for a gulp shrimp. By far the biggest fish I've ever caught on a gulp shrimp. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna bring this fish in real quick. We're gonna get a measure right here on the sea deck, get a picture, and then we'll let her go. Oh, holy cow. My gosh. <laughs> wow. Oh. <laughs> that is <laughs> whoa that is a giant right there by far the biggest fish i've ever caught on a gulp shrimp beautiful louisiana bull red <sighs> that's epic really sick All right, we're gonna quickly measure this fish. Let's, oh. Okay, just kidding. No, we're not measuring this fish. <laughs> I literally took a few photos with it, go to spin around to put them on the ruler, and Time there we have it. It was probably it was probably just over 40 inches. Really, really heavy fish, like a 30 pound fish. But yeah, got him there on this uh, this gulp. That's new penny right there. So it worked. It caught him. So I fished him. That's three fish down. Let's keep going. Oh, big fish. Oh, right at, there you go, Maggie. All right. Is your drag set accordingly? I think you're good. I think you're good. There it is, right on the point like we thought.
No way. Black drum. You just got a drum on a. <laughs> no way. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Big black. No way. I cannot believe. That's well, so actually, funny. I can't believe that. Let me see. It's a whole day without a redfish. Thought I had one, and it's a black drum. <laughs> What in the, what are the odds of that? Maybe that's why I was not getting bit by that fish we saw on the side scan. They were just a drum? Possibly? Yeah. How about that? First fish in Louisiana, right? It's yeah. a black drum on a gold spoon. That's, I mean, that's pretty incredible. It happened once last year, but I think it's very yeah, I, rare. I was gonna ask. I think it's very rare. Black drum on a gold spoon. All right, let's land them. Oh. <laughs> wow, Maggie. Oh, no. Nice drum. Is that your biggest drum? Oh, yeah. <laughs> He's, that's a 32 inch drum. Yeah. All right, let's hold them up. Get a picture and we'll release them. That's awesome. How about that? Beautiful drum. I mean, 32 inch drum. He's like probably 20 pounds. That is your biggest drum. And he is beautiful. Oh, you Barely got him. Hooked. Barely hooked? Yeah. I mean, it came right out. All right. You do, you do the honors and release them. I'll move this rod here. Oh, you, yeah, bleeding a little bit, so you definitely got him in the tongue. Oh, yep, you should be good. There he goes. Hey! <laughs> I can't believe that. I can't believe that. I bet there's more all around here. Let's keep fishing. Nice job. Alright guys, well, we are hopping back on the road to head back to our Airbnb where there might potentially be no hot water. <laughs> so after a 50 degree day on the water, yeah, um, <laughs> we knocked out some fish today, I will say. It wasn't as good as I would have hoped because I do think we had the right weather to make it like an epic day. But uh, yeah, I mean, we just didn't really find a whole lot of fish like floating and and really showing themselves like I, I hoped for. Kind of messed around with, I think, some dirtier water for a good portion of the day, which I should have saved myself and just got up and moved when it, right as I saw that and tried a different spot. Um, but yeah, we still, I was able to, able to sight fish a bull uh, and I got two really nice reds, uh, some like mid-sized ones as well. Maggie caught a black drum on a spoon. That was really neat. And uh, yeah, I think it was just a good, like, solid first day in Louisiana. Now, once again, we're going to be here for two more days, so two more videos coming your way. And uh, I'm excited. I think tomorrow we're going to try to mix in, like, some NLBN baits and uh, try to knock out some big fish again. And then uh, the third day, we might grab some live shrimp, but that is, uh, we'll figure that out as we go. And uh, great job today, Maggie. What do you think? It's awesome. It was awesome? Really different. Really different, yeah. I agree. I agree. Very different. Um, very cold. This was a really yeah. dang cold <laughs> day. But uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Stay tuned for videos uh, coming up from Louisiana. And uh, yeah, I think that's it. I'll see you guys in the next video.